We are under the 10 day mark now. The Winter Olympics are almost here and there is a lot happening right now in Beijing. News for Tucson's Robbie Reynolds has an update for us. Just nine days to go. Winter Olympics are right around the corner. We have a lot to get to today. The Beijing Olympics Committee has just confirmed 13 new COVID-19 cases connected to the Winter Olympics. In a statement released this morning, the committee says nine of those cases were found in recent arrivals who tested positive at Chinese customs. Rehearsals for the opening ceremony of the Beijing Winter Olympics were held this weekend at the National Stadium. The state broadcaster CCTV showed performers practicing dance routines with participants ranging in ages from 5 years old to over 70 years old. The United States Olympic and Paralympic Committee has announced the 2022 U.S. Olympic team. The U.S. OPC said the 222-member team features 99 returning Olympians, including four five-time Olympians. Wow, Sean White in half pipe on snowboarding, Lindsay Jacob Ellis in snowboard cross, Katie Ulander in skeleton, and John Schuster in curling. In Beijing, residents are facing lockdowns imposed with little notice. As the Chinese capital seeks to prevent a major coronavirus outbreak, the lockdowns are part of the Chinese zero tolerance measures to fight the pandemic that have been ratcheted up ahead of the games. At least six Beijing neighborhoods have been targeted for lockdowns and officials in Beijing said that they would conduct a second round of mass testing. Robbie Reynolds, News 4 Tucson.